Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. This is your monthly love reading for the sign of Leo for December. Uh, first of all, I want to thank everybody for all your kind words, your love and kindness and patience. Uh, in the last month, I was sick and in the hospital for 10 days and <clears throat> have been recuperating since. People are wondering where I've been because I haven't been posting my daily messages. I um, thought I had the flu and I ended up um, being in the hospital. I had a kidney infection that went into my bloodstream and I went into septic shock. My kidney shut down and so I was fighting that for 10 days. I came home and still was recuperating. I just went back to work last week. So it's been a long month. I feel like I've lost a month of my life. I kind of did. Uh, so um, I'm thankful for everybody. Um, you know, the people I've never met who were extending their love and um, uh, healing to me. So, uh, okay, so on with the reading now. Um, this is a reading for the sign of Leo. And it is not meant for every Leo out there. Okay, this, uh, if it resonates with you, that's great. If you'd like to have a private reading, I'm more than happy to help you. My email address will be at the bottom of this video. Um, email me, I can send you all the information to get a private reading. I really enjoy doing love readings and relationship readings. I'm an empath, so I can, what I can do is if you're like, if you're, uh, not feeling uh, confident in the relationship, you don't know what's going on, you're a little bit confused, they're sending you mixed signals. Um, I'm That's where I really am pretty good at reading other people. That's what I do. So I feel what that person is feeling. So um, that's why uh, I'm so much better at those readings than love, sorry, than career and finance and so forth. I still can do that, but um, because I can feel the emotions of other people, love readings are where I um, shine. And I also do tarot cards. So I will give an energy reading <clears throat> and a tarot spread. Okay. All right. So the very first card that I pulled for you, Leo's here, is passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. So the, this card is telling you that right now you need to have a little more passion in your life. All right. Whatever it is you're passionate about, start doing that if it's a special activity or whatever the case is um stir your heart with joy and help the passion bubble forth and uh do this also in your romantic life okay um and so this card is saying that if you have passion for life um itself um it is a rec a requisite foundation for feeling passion in your love life and it talks about enjoying the moment completely with your partner and if you're single, allow, so if you're single, then you can definitely enjoy passion in your activities and hobbies. And while doing this, you can meet a wonderful partner, okay? So have some passion in your relationship, passion in your life, and it will bring more into your life. Okay, it is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all, all right? And if you meet that person, it is safe to love. If you're already with that person, open your heart. All right. Um, so this card is indicating that you're protecting your heart from hurt because of perhaps past experiences. And um, allow yourself to love. You meet that person, allow it to come in. Trust your intuition. And uh, open your heart to those who are kind and gentle. All right, ask the angels to bring someone into your life that are kind and gentle. Okay, all right, so that's your second card right there to say for you to love and engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. All right, who knows? All right, start, allow that passion to come in. Open your heart. It'll, it could deepen that relationship that you're in. All right. Um, If you're in a present relationship, this could be on the horizon. And this, re this card is reassuring you 
to release those worries and uh, about whether you'll get married because you will. All right. Uh, deep romantic, re deep romantic love is in the cards for you. Christmas is coming. You never know. Somebody might get an engagement ring this month. And so this card is really relating to commitment. And uh, so this could include the promise of marriage. All right. Really nice message for uh, you Leos out there. All right. Allow that passion to come into your life. Be more passionate about the person you're with. All right. Open your heart. And when you open your heart, you will receive the highest energy, which could lead to more commit, a, a deeper commitment and engagement. All right. Okay, all of you Leos, I really hope you enjoy this reading and this message. And like I said, if you're interested in getting a private reading, please email me and we can set that up. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye.